I'll go first. Uh, okay. My character or just my, uh, like, everything about me? Uh, he plugs everything, more or less. Uh, keep it short and simple. Okay. Uh, I'm Ketsun Ursa. I have a YouTube that I haven't uploaded in two years. I might sometime. Uh, but if you are interested in looking at me, try looking me up at Ketsun Ursa on yeah, Kitchen are sufficient on YouTube. Uh, I haven't uploaded that anything in like two years, as I said. Uh, and I will be playing Fall, the tobacco, the. <laughs> Sorry, I keep stuttering. Uh, the Mag- Marge Taxi, Tabaxi. Ah, you're good. I can't kid. speak. Words. Yeah, Marge Tabaxi. <laughs> My God. Marge Tabaxi. Sorcerer. Wild Magic mm-hmm. Sorcerer. Mm hmm. Alright, whoever wants to go up next, go right ahead. I shall plug myself. Okay. Um, I'm uh, just. I'm... Oh. You go ahead, Gypsy. Go ahead. One at a time. <laughs> yep. Okay. I'm uh, Gypsy. Gypsy Dangeresque. You can find me at twitch.tv slash Gypsy Dangeresque. Uh, I will be playing the character Galahad. I'm friends IRL with the next gentleman to introduce himself. Oh, well, thank you, sir. Hello, I'm the Storm Mage. You can find me on YouTube at Storm Mage. Um, I really don't have anything too much on that channel other than the Monster Madness campaigns. I run with these guys here and some in-state friends. And I will be playing the role of Gungear T. Homunculus, the Artificer. All right. Uh, Tom Dragon, whoever wants to go next. Uh, go ahead, Tom. You can go first. All right. I am Mustache Tom. You can find me on YouTube and Twitter at Mustache Tom. You can see me playing uh, various video games and doing movie reviews. That is, once again, at Mustache Tom. And I will be playing Ravik the Storm Cleric Kobold. All right. All right. Uh, uh, I am Dragon Seven Eight Five, playing as uh, Azamar Radolf, the Human Blood Hunter. I don't really have much of a paper trail online. Mm. All right, <clears throat> and I am Captain Venom, the uh, group of, I guess, what are we schmucks? <laughs> well, for the most part. <laughs> Anywho, uh, you can find me on uh, Twitter at Captain Venom One Five Eight. Uh, you can find me here on Twitch at Captain Venom Fifteen because somebody stole my eight. Because you know jokes. And uh, you can find me also on YouTube at uh, Captain Venom One Five Eight. So yeah. Without further ado, gentlemen, let us get started with all this shenanigans. Let us quest, let us quest, let us quest to lands unknown. All right, let me get my intro up. We, uh, yeah, should have had that ready, but I didn't think about it. Because I'm an idiot. That's okay. Bad DM. Shush. I will smite thee. <clears throat> okay, is everybody ready? Yes. 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 Okay. What was the question? Sorry. Go sit in the Kit. corner. <laughs> <laughs> go think about your life. <laughs> Whatever, you're not my dad. God opens the clouds. Sit in the corner. <laughs> <coughs> Closes so, them. I am a little bit sick to those in chat, so uh, bear with me. <laughs> Anywho, I welcome you gentlemen into the world of the Ethereal Plains. I will actually pull up the world map, which should be in your guys' journal. So that's our world, lovely world map. I found that on Pinterest. There we go. It's a 
big, massive continent, as you guys can tell from, well, you all have a world map that's in your inventory. Edit that in later. <clears throat> so this world is basically, you guys, well, came along here for fun, adventure, the search for magical items that this world is known to have. You guys will be starting in the port town of Regalia on the eastern side of the continent. Where we will be starting our adventure. So. It's an average sunny day in the city of Regalia. Well, I should say kingdom. It's a small kingdom ruled by one Rudolph, the king of Regalia. And I had to make sure I didn't butcher that name, because <laughs> words. <clears throat> so, you guys are hanging around uh, in the tavern. Uh, it's about noon-ish in the after, like 1, a 1 p.m. in the afternoon. Uh, you guys got finished with your quests for the day, like some small errands here and there. And uh, you're all enjoying a meal, drink, whatever you wish, as you're uh, showing in the tavern. Uh, random question. Mm -hmm. Is it assumed that we know each other, or have we just randomly met? You've at least known each like at least known each other's names. You never really worked person together. Just common faces okay. at the tavern. More or less, yes. To keep it simple. Okay. Is there anything anybody wants to do? Uh, I I enjoy my m milk. Whatever <laughs> they would let me have. <laughs> All right. Paul is, Paul sure. Is just I like mean, a glass of water. My sure. character is fifteen. Oh, 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 I did not know that. <laughs> you never <laughs> specificized. Yeah, they would have served no, you said, either no, milk, or juice, or water. Either. Or light wine, considering it's not that alcoholic. Oh, Gungi will take an orange I, juice. And I... <laughs> Alright, that, that'll be... Uh, I'm going to say at least... At least what now? 50 silver. Fif oh, 50 silver? Uh, I uh, hold on a minute. Let me just make sure. Yeah, that sounds a bit expensive. Wait, hold on a minute. No, I I effed up. I typo. Uh, twenty five. That for, still sounds super expensive for an orange juice. Yeah, no. Uh, no, 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 not for the cost. I mean, on your person. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh uh, wait, we all have twenty five extra. Yeah, on top of whatever else you had in your inventory. Okay, Gun Gear's already... I don't think I was ever given money, like, because of my... Oh, no, that's Yay. right, we chose a custom background. Yeah, 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 the custom background. You would have yeah. actually had an... 25 on your person, uh, kit. Okay, so, I have a total of 50. Okay, I think... Yep, everybody else should at least have whatever they had from their last campaign that you guys... Okay, yeah, Gun Gear... Got additional 25. An additional 25 silver. Okay. Drop it on. Correct. And oh, uh, the orange juice would have only cost you two. Uh, oh, wait, wait, water wait, wait, is wait. free. Like two wait, copper? Wait, hold on. Uh, yeah, like two copper, uh, basically. It's pretty so cheap. Confused right now. Is it Conversions money? are one to, uh, two to one. So uh, two copper equals one silver. Actually, no, I'll hold on a minute. Uh, usually it's like oh, 10, no, one 10, to 10. 100. Okay, so how much money do we have? Okay, Kit should have 50 silver. I don't oh, know about silver? the rest of you guys. Um, God, Gun that's Gear, cheap. Gun Gear's got 43 gold, 25 silver, or tw oh wait, no, that's Electro I put that into. Silver is, that'll be 31 silver Oops. and 3 copper. Okay. Actually, I still have no right, idea of figuring out how. Time. Uh, generally, I, I literally did that same. Can mistake. I just give myself like twenty gold or something like that? 
Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'll say you each at least have 20 gold uh, additional. So I have 50 silver and 20 gold. Hmm. Correct. <sighs> there we Works go. for me. Alright, so... Anything uh, else that you guys want to do while you're chilling Paul here? Paul will actually be looking at the various drinks that they have. Okay, uh, you can roll a perception check if... Come on, perception. First roll of the game. Thirteen. Thirteen. Okay, not bad. Uh, you notice the common ales, drinks. There are a couple specialties. Ooh. What are the specialties? Uh, the specialties include... Oh, God. Here. <laughs> Apologies if I swear it's chat. That's just me. Uh, ba, 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 ba. They have squid ale. Don't ask. And they have eels delight as their house specialty. Um, okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, so Marky, what does he recommend? Squid ale, squid ale, or s eels delight? Maybe they've got whales. Well, let me grog. roll this. What? Maybe they've I, got... I have to make a roll. Okay, he recommends uh, Eels Delight. Uh. Okay, I'll take Eels Delight. I was hoping to make a joke with uh, squids, but okay. Eels Delight. All right, so that will cost you uh, five silver. Okay, I hand him five Ooh. silver. Do you think All they right, call it so. Eels Delight because Eels like it? <laughs> Do you say this aloud or out of character? Yeah, Gungu says this aloud. Uh, hold on a minute. Let me, let me see who overhears you. Oh god, natural one, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> the first natural one of the game, and it's by the DM for random NPCs, so no one really uh... overhears you, unless if the other players wants to make a perception to overhear Grungear. Oh, uh, sure. Sure. 21. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Not Overheard. Bad. Yes. Well, I mean, I don't know too many eels that like alcohol, but you know, you never really know. Uh, Fall is kind of just chuckling at this idea. Okay, well... You're a very in and walked over to Gun Gear. You're a very interesting... Thing. And you're a talking uh, kitty cat. Hello, Mr. Kitty Cat. Um, actually, I'm a tabaxi. Yeah, you're a kitty cat. Uh. Indeed, I think I've saw I've seen a few of your kinds strolling about in the streets. <laughs> in fact, you, you actually have. They're quite merchant folk. Oh, that's a natural twenty from. Game they're quite what folk? <laughs> I think they're uh, like quite to common. Uh, merchant folk, uh, tabaxi, they're commonly seen as. Okay. Uh, I'll ask the barkeep for a few. Does he just hand me a shot or like the bottle? Uh, it's like it's like a beer bottle, basically. Okay, I asked him for a few glasses. Galad, you you would notice this easily with your natural twenty. <laughs> I, 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 I head over and okay. sit down across from uh, uh, across from uh, him and I, I say have you ever seen an eel to drink? Well I mean they're in the water all the time so I guess they're always drinking ah, but to them no, but us water is but air yeah does that mean that we're all drinking air right now? I suppose in a way. Fucking god. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Like, think about these things. Cause you know, <laughs> when it gets you up when the air gets you up into the clouds, it starts to turn into rain. Or is it the other way around? I'm not that good with meteorology. <laughs> then it starts all pouring on down. And so we're kind of like we're drinking the air. I... How that works? I thought the goddess of rain would you know, whip up some 
some rainy stuff. Oh, I mean, God's good Jesus Christ, guys. This is already a train wreck. <laughs> what do you expect? Man, you you ask how a bunch the world of... works? Come what on. do you expect? You ask a bunch of idiots to who have never I, met I each you. other to do a and d game. Well, I beg your pardon, sir. I have an 18 intelligence. That was out of character! You don't know that, though. I'm not an idiot! I'm a very average intelligence! <laughs> oh my Let god! Me average! Can we please stop? <laughs> well, I'm just enjoying Jesus. my orange juice. I don't know what you're complaining about. Look at it. It's so orange. Oh, and filled with juice. And filled with pork. I... Order. Order in the court, please. I... I hand... In the court. Some of the gla shot glasses to them. And fill up glass. <gasps> You mean I get to drink? Daddy never sure. lets me drink. Daddy? Yeah, my daddy. <sighs> he says, I'm Gungir. I'm my temples. <laughs> he says, Gungir, don't go drinking so much. You'll turn into a raging alcoholic. And oh that's never fun. <laughs> that's so bad. Oh, got him <laughs> Anyway, I poured out. I pour like uh, there are five of us. I pour five glasses. Yeah, again, I don't know how I'll become an alcoholic because you know I'm a construct and I don't really digest alcohol. Ex uh, Paul kind of widens his eyes at you saying that. Did you say construct? I said a lot of things. Are we going to drink? Oh, I'm sure. so I mean, you excited. can't move around. I'm happy to get to drinking You're orange. Constructed. Glad you can have my orange juice if you want a toast. You can't move. Okay, well, like if you bound by drink a this, you're all going to be needing to make a constitution saving throw. Mm, I'm good at those. Oh no! Oh Drunk boy! Drunk gun here! Kind of oh no! Oh no! Galahad. Oh, Galahad has a good drink here. and goes. Okay. Oh nine. no! Nine. <laughs> Ten. What, what nine. Is nine. <laughs> this is great. This is great. Okay. <laughs> oh no! What is about a plus two. seven con save? There's nothing. I'm gonna roll threes. Drunk. Oh, oh gun gear. Gear. Oh, con save. I thought you just said constitution. Yeah, constitution save. Wait, just oh, re-roll that. Constitution. I didn't need to put a constitution. Oh. in constitution. Drunk gun gear. It's both tragic and hysterical. Okay, uh... Okay. Hey, just... Oh, there you go. Everybody passed. Surprising one. <laughs> you Damn. don't know me. What does the alcohol taste like? It tastes... somewhat salty, very warm to the core. It's not bad. Not bad. I, I still spit it out. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what is what is in this? It's on my face. Oh. It's downright swill. It's I so asked the barkeep what what's in this exactly. Okay, they list off sea salt. <laughs> yep, yeah, and the ocean. eel mucus. <laughs> oh. And surprisingly, it tastes good as an alcoholic drink. Is it like really thick and like gooey? Yes. Like a lager? Yes. Oh. Yes. Okay. When I heard this, I thought you were going to make, make us take some lightning oh. damage. No. No. <laughs> no, you actually managed to beat the save on it, which was only oh, wait. five. Tom never rolled. I never said I drank. <laughs> Yeah, oh, I said whoever okay. wanted to partake had to roll. Anywho, it's not it's all of you. Roll perception check for me. It's all thick and gooey. Perception. <sighs> this tastes like the time that I picked my nose and I ate the booger. <laughs> God damn it. 
Okay, to be okay. fair, I didn't actually eat that booger. A little kitty cat came along and I let him eat it because he was a stray and he needs the protein. Oh. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay, there we go. Eleven. Okay, uh, let's see. Fall, you notice this top, um, Ravik. Uh, names. Ravik. Ravik, you notice this. And Gallad, you notice this. The, you, you two blundering idiots don't notice this. But you see a cloaked figure enter the tavern. Like, full body cloak, covering the face and all. Walks up to a table where there was a bunch of uh, random schmucks, like sailors, whatnot, in common sailor uniform. Sits down at their table as they were, like, in the middle of a card game, and they're just like, do you freaking mind? Like, you actually overhear that. And then they just get up and walk away, leaving this person alone. Azzy, do you think if I set this on fire, I can get all, like, the sea salt out and have, like, just a hard chunk of salt? Mm. I don't know. I mean, Might be worth trying out. I mean, it'd probably smell from sending the mucus what, on fire. What do you do with a... What, what do you do with a, a, a huge chunk of salt, though? Whatever you need salt for. I mean, you could give it to a horse. Horses love salt. That they do. <laughs> I'm going to roll perception to see if I notice anything about this person. All right. Fifteen. All right. Uh, besides the um, cloak that they're wearing... Besides the cloak, there's not... Mm, you do notice, like, like you know, like glasses would, like on the bridge of your nose that cover their eyes, and all you see is from nose down. It, they're human, or at least appear to be, and the uh, mask shape itself is that of a butterfly, but it's okay. intricately designed. I walk over, curious. Hello? Yep, uh, you walk over? Alright, she, uh... Wow, I already gave her... Wow! Yep. <laughs> supposed to be mysterious, but anywho, that, that's spoiled. Anywho, she looks up to you and nods. Hey, uh... I... Hmm, I'm trying to think what to do. It's okay, it's her amazing rack that gave it away. <laughs> you can't actually tell. <laughs> no. No, 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 her IKEA furniture. Like she she <laughs> oh has to have a nice rack. <laughs> uh, Some assembly required. You're, you're gonna have to learn to be with these Perfect. idiots. He's a construct, he's great at assembly. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm already <laughs> mm, I'm already cringing and this is an we're getting into plot. We're just, you know, just getting into it. I'm, I'm really sorry. That's fine. I'll, I'll deal with it. Uh, I asked the mysterious figure. Uh, any reason someone like you come is coming here? She nods and says. I'm for higher. Uh, I could not understand. You cut out. Yeah. Okay. Uh, my B. Uh, let me let me refresh here. See if that'll do anything. Might be just be your sensitivity. All right. Am I good? It might be your sensitivity. But it doesn't. It sounded all that sentence sounded great. Yeah. When you came back. Hello. Am I good? Hey, yeah, you sound hello. good. You sound good. Okay, good. I just yeah. muted myself and unmuted. Okay. 
I you might just want to mess with sanity. I didn't really mess with that, but anywho, uh, where the heck was I? Uh, she looks uh, up at you and says, "He's responding." Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm looking for hired work. Something, somebody, or a group of people to get something back that was taken from me. Uh, are any of you gonna like try to hear this or something? Well, perception. I they mean, want to overhear it. I mean, Grungear and I haven't even didn't even notice her walking in. So Gungear, I left the group. It's true. Yeah, Gungear currently has his his like jar of lager it's... just like upside down. Oh, but... Like like it's a Jello mold, and it's trying to shape it into something. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm just sitting there watching him kind of <laughs> chuckling a little bit as I try to stomach most of it. I asked. Uh, like okay, fine. I guess watching. I asked. I rolled for the year 18. Oh. Yep, you would overhear there a bit. Right, you would hear basically the whole part. Uh, Ravik will come over. So. Does this job of yours involve battle? A little bit, yes. Not too much. Hmm. It's more or less go in, steal back what was mine, try to get out on. But if there is battle afoot, then so be it. I can't do anything about it. Could you give us any more details on it? So I was wandering to, into town a bit for a, a, a couple days ago, or at least heading here from one of the other cities, and I was robbed by bandits. They gave me two options, give up my weapons or my body, and I didn't want the first option, the, the second option, so I gave up my weapon, the only good one that I had. She shows uh, a basically a silver rapier and a silver dagger that are non-magical but pretty standardized weapons they stole my personal sword over everything else I see where would this sword be exactly well the Bandit that stole it from me hide away near the forest outside of town. Uh, you cut out a bit. God damn it. <laughs> Am I good now? Yeah. Yeah. You're good uh, you, you said the bandit, then pods, hide away. And then outside of town. Okay. Uh, the uh, I'll just repeat what I said. Uh, the bandits that stole my blade went into their fortress outside of town in the forest. Okay. Uh, I'll look at Ravik. So, yeah, what do you want? Do you think we should take up the job? Well, I mean... If we're gonna crack some skulls, <laughs> I'm down. I'm gonna try to listen in after possibly hearing the Ooh, prospect skulls. of a job. There we go. I think I should at least hear hear this part. Yes, you definitely it, should. Right? <laughs> oh, yes. Are we taking up a job that involves cracking skulls? I'm intrigued. <laughs> Slightly, I could pay all of you. Uh, is it uh, some is it if you're willing to calling? do this for me? Uh, Why did you oh, say? Well, uh, hmm. I was asking uh, Gypsy what he said. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, I said, is that an is it a bit of a noble calling? Is it like a a daring rescue or uh, we're going to go slay a dragon? 
More stealing something. Recovering well, something. Back. Stealing something. Well, recovering. I'll recover now. That's way different. I won't steal from someone, but I'll take something back. No problem. It involves stealing from someone, though. It's stealing from well, the bandits. Or the, from the, Are they a the jerk? Bad people. <laughs> Trust me, I've stolen from a person or two in my time. Alright, let's, let's try this again, shall we? Hopefully this works. Alright, we are back stream. <laughs> Let me die first. <clears throat> Alright, I think I'm good. Alright, so that was the line. I'm not going to repeat it because fuck it. Well, cool. Listen, my purview when it came to my career as a thief were... were apple stands and... And blanket f hanging out of window. Hmm. Then to you haven't found. gone too deep, then. Then again, I wasn't the one that stole the things. It was an associate of mine, but regardless, they shall not be named, and I shall not say my name. Well, okay. that was my true identity. Mine's got a hat. A pleasure. So pure and innocent. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> See, we know each other now. Sh she shrugs and uh, shakes her head. All right, well, the reward for each of you, if you manage to bring the blade back to me, is... Uh, 50 gold a piece, if that seems doable. A little I light, but sounds... uh, this should be fine. I'm not one to complain. You're talking about, you're talking about stealing from royals for 50 no, gold not, a piece. No, 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 no. That no, was no. a she feat. That was a she story. She got stolen by a thief. It's not anything going to be that tough, is it? No, 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 you're no, just no. retrieving my weapon back from the bandits that stole it from me. I love that she's Whoa, asking right. a group to, to steal from to steal from someone when they have no rogue. Yeah, we do I seem mean, to be kind of at a disadvantage. I mean, my character's uh, strength line fighting monsters and the occult's not really people, but I'm not opposed to it. From what I remember, there was only, I think, six or seven of them, but there might be more in their fortress. Humble beginnings, I guess. You'll have no problems at all. I know my way around a lock and a door, and I know my way around an alleyway, and you run away, and then you don't let them cut your head off, and that's how you steal. I suppose, but these... If it's that simple, <clears throat> should have taken it up a long time ago. May or may not be so um, bright, as it were. Anyways, any other things you find there are yours to keep if you manage to either dispatch them or seal it back. Regardless, I'll pay you. I don't know if I speak for the party here, but I say we are all, we're in agreement. Are we not? I'm. We throwing a party. I just made a small gel yeah. mold of Ravik. Look, I made it with the logger. <gasps> I look over. What? How? How? Wait, what did you make That's with your impressive. logger? <laughs> He made a small jello man of uh of Ravik using the water. <laughs> it looks just like him. Gungir hasn't been Gungir hasn't been paying attention this entire time. <laughs> we'll explain it to him on the road. Gungir. Gungir. I suppose. Gungir. Gally. Gally. Now you've yeah. been focused in on your art. It looks just like him, except smaller and made of water. I get it. 
It's very impressive. Yeah. It's very impressive. Yeah, I'm it is. I'm appalled by it. Yeah. There's, there's a potential job, and I think we're, we're going to go in on it. I love jobs. <laughs> Jesus, you're, you're setting this man up for fucking... Uh, what the hell is it? Uh, you're the boss, and he's the freaking grunt. <laughs> and you're gonna just make like that. longer like, art. He's getting a little distracted. <laughs> my God. Holy they. You've got to point uh, him in the right direction sometimes. Yeah, oh. I do get lost. Real easily. <laughs> can, we, can we go now? Yes. Maybe our first destination should be the door. <laughs> Out, please, before I lose my sanity. Gungir scoops up his backpack and he, he follows on through. Where are we going, guys? So, Good. I'm gonna say, for sake of brevity, you I manage to go into the forest. Uh, I will have, okay, everybody roll survival check for me, please. Oh, oh boy. I am proficient in this. Oh, <laughs> roll like it. What was that? Well, that's a six. Th those natural ones, though, G natural 20 from Grunk. Holy Jesus. crap! I'm remembering my time when I got lost in my backyard. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Well, I, had to, I had to survive off sticks. We either are getting very, very good rolls or just awful rolls. It's not boating well. Mm, yeah. Gungi seems like he's got a good head on his shoulders. I told you we can all rely on him. Okay. I got, yeah, I got I, lost I, I in my must... back in like my backyard for like two hours, and I got <laughs> and they found me in the shed. Okay, Grunk here, you could easily see that their path was hidden by like they put up fake bushes and whatnot. This is just sloppy um, work. And yeah, they did it very poorly, and you can even see like some of their grunts out like patrolling the area like not even in great camouflage i would have disguised uh, this path with at least two bushes uh tom fall you also notice this as well there it, it, it's awful these bandits are fucking dumb as shit <laughs> that would make my character dumber as well as galahad for not being able to see it <laughs> yup i just wasn't trying Wait till I get into the groove of things. I'm used to cities. Forests are all confusing. They're wood and they're not uh, uh, stone. And they're like wood cities. No, a, a small voice said, uh, 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 "Shut up!" To you, uh, and you, you look Who said down. That? <laughs> Do you look down? I absolutely look down at you what feel voice small? is to shut up. Can we please oh, not break the DM first? Game? What does he see, <clears throat> Venom? Oh, did I cut out? Yeah. Yep. Oh, that yeah. that's my B. I, I was going into detail, and I didn't know. Anywho, I'm good now, correct? Yes. Okay, good. You look down and you see a white kobold with wings out her back. A kobold with wings? Yes, a white kobold with wings and a bow. Are they bat wings or feathery Excuse wings? Excuse me. Like Excuse dragon me, wings. Excuse me, rude? Uh, yeah, I kind of uh, was hired by points uh, thumb back towards the town. Her as well. We're old friends. Oh, well, welcome as... aboard the great team. I mean, as long as we're all getting paid 50, right? The more the merrier. I mean, as long as... As long as my his pay isn't coming out of mine, then I don't care. Look, I can climb into the trees and give you archery support. Just to keep it simple. I think um, that, that we try some something that doesn't what? involve sounds, bloodshed. That sounds like a real strategy, like you'd use in a battle. She face palms. Ravik, it's a white Genius. version of you. What? 
Are you think all kobolds are the same? No, I just said um, it's a white version of him. Um, guys. Oh, that's fair then. <laughs> I presentation. I presentation. Uh, little sparks in my hand. I can provide backup as well. Ooh. We'll see how well you do in battle. And she climbs up a fucking tree with ease. I draw I'm going to my longsword and kite shield uh, and begin by taking point. I'm okay. going to try to stealth in like some bushes. Okay. Uh, by the way, there is no map, so we're going to theater the mind this. That 17. I never, I never got to set that up. Like I couldn't figure it out. So hopefully by next week I'll figure out how to do maps. All right. All right. For those of you who want to stealth, you may stealth. I'm surprised Ravik hasn't just charged blindly. <laughs> I'll try. Okay. Well, you see the entrance to the fortress. Uh, about 30 feet in front of you. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, no! <laughs> oh, no, natural one. Well, now I have to roll perception for these dumb guards. I don't know. One? <laughs> well, they both see you. Look out, intruders! <laughs> Wait, what did he do? He rolled a natural one I'm stealth. No, I know that, but what happened in the roleplay? Uh, he got spotted by stepping on a a very big twig, and I it went on a crunch. <laughs> <laughs> no, Gally, you're supposed to step on your smaller ones. And then the two uh, patrol guards start rushing you with uh, javelins. Uh, roll for initiative, oh, gentlemen. That, I'm outside in a forest. I hate forests. I forgot about foliage. Oh, I forgot to put my character out. Yep, make sure your sheets are up. I got these boys' HP up. Let's begin. Well, no, we actually can do tokens and stuff like that to keep initiative order good. Oh, wow. Me and Storm rolled the exact same. Okay, who has the uh, higher decks? I'll, I'll let Fall go first, actually. Yeah, 23. <laughs> now I'm getting my good rolls back. It's okay, I actually have a sheet of paper for initiative as well. Because okay, I rolled well, there for these is boys. the initiative board. Yeah, I know. I, I drank my meh. character on, like... Oh, there we go. How do I... Just out of character, it'd probably be good for, like, future, like, Twitch things, just to have it there. Yeah. Make sure all your things... Uh, I'm not gonna have a token. Because I didn't... <laughs> So she will actually you forgot to roll for her. Oh. Damn it, Dice Tower, you failed me. I'm slow rolling. I'm slow rolling because I'm gonna have the best initiative. Ready? Well, good luck being a twenty-three. No. <laughs> hey, close! Dang. I tried. Gally, I don't think they want to give us hugs with those sharp sticks. And one sec, I'm just finishing up my initiative. Okay, so... 23 for you, 17 for that guy, and a lousy 2 for that guy. Okay, uh... Azamar Radolf, you are going first. Sounds good. Go get him, Azzy. <laughs> and let me make sure I have help their help HP correct. I'm spotted! Help, help, help! Alright, so what do you want to do? Uh, I'm going to rush the one that's closest to me and just strike with my longsword. Okay. Ooh, so you run up nice. and roll to hit. Okay, that will definitely hit. Seven, Ooh. okay. Uh, which one do you want to hit, number one or number two? Uh, again, whichever one is closest. Okay, so that'd be number one, so minus seven to him. Okay. And does that conclude your turn? Uh, at the moment, uh, not much else I could do. 
All right, next up is Galad. Glad is here. All right, uh, I've got this. I can do this. I just take the crystal and I take this. I take this uh, gem that was tied around my neck like a makeshift pendant, and I hold mm-hmm. it out before me. And mm-hmm. I fire off an eldritch blast at the first one. All right, roll the hit. Let me find the... The spell. Boop. Oh! <laughs> oh, no! Well, time to roll severity. It well, was my actual that's, D100. That's rough. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, God, that's a 19. I mean, that's not what? bad. Okay, I need you to roll me a... Roll a, a what? A 1d8. You cut out. That a one d eight. Am I good? Okay. Three. Okay, you got it. Three. Okay. Uh, roll damage, please, for me. Okay. Let me just make sure. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 da. Who is fall? Okay, fall. You take that damage as it uh, careens it wildly into you. Ah. Ouch. Okay, Were as that happens, I just imagine... Rules? Okay, as that happens, I just imagine it hitting Fall in the butt, and he just does a Tom scream as he jumps up. <laughs> yeah, Tom and Jerry scream. Nice, nice. Ah! Uh, that Thank and you. the Wilhelm scream are probably some of the best ones. Ah! All right, Gallant, does that end your turn? <coughs> Gallant, you're supposed to shoot the other guys. I throw daggers at Gallant. <laughs> oh, God, oh. wait, did you see? Listen, I... How much damage? Four. Four. Oh, no! You had to choose me. I, I asked him to roll 1d3. Ah! I'm sorry. Congratulations. Congratulations. You just hit the glass cannon. Oh, also, that's a 1d10, not a 1d8. But, oh, well, actually, no, the first one was a 3. Actually, never mind. Uh, never mind. Scrap that. Uh, who is up next? Uh, that would be... Blah, 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 blah. Fall. Sorry. <laughs> uh... Fall is staring daggers at at uh, Glad. Um, and are these guys like close to each other, like the bad guys? Yeah, they're like within five feet of each other. Just watch oh, out for me casting yeah. spells. As you see him just like staring daggers at you, you watch as the. Uh, Staff he's holding suddenly gets a green colored bubble like thing and he sh- and he shoots acid splash at these two bad guys. Alright, roll for your wild magic. Oh boy. A one D one D one hundred. No, it's one D twenty. Oh one D twenty, my bad. If it lands on a one, it then it's then a one D one hundred. Mm-hmm. Okay, you're good. So. so. Pew! Yep. Uh, to number one or number two? Uh, I think it, acid it splashes. splashes. Yeah. It, it, oh, right. Uh, then that's to make three a, to both of them. Yeah, they or have to choose make a deck to, save. Yeah, or choose to that. Hold on, uh, let me roll their six. Eight. And, and a I two. I thought it was... I thought it was after I cast the spell. Yeah, after you cast the spell, they have to make a reflex save uh, to take. No, no, no! I thought it was I roll one d twenty after I cast the spell. Oh, oh, for your wild magic. I I, I don't remember. Uh, uh, I, I, I will post that. what my feet says because I right. copied this like word for word. All right, give me a minute to read this uh, via DM do, do, or not. Do, oh no! Do, do, It'd be on the first level spell. And this that. is a cantrip. Yep. So you're good. I didn't even need to roll the one d twenty. 
Yeah, that that's my bad. I thought it was every spell. Alright, uh, I assume that ends your turn? Yep. Alright, next up is... Actually, Stol- actually oh. wait, I will get a bit further back. You'll, you'll move like 10, 15 feet? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Mr. Storm Mage, you're up next. Ah, Gungio's turn. Well, you see, uh, let me bring up his ability real quick. Here we go. You see Gungear, uh, reach into his, um, satchel, and he pulls out this metal cylinder that's got a little pin in it. Uh, he pulls the pin and chucks it, and does... Oh, and it didn't show on there. Shit. <laughs> Uh, Technical difficulties, chat. That seems to be a theme for a night. Uh, He will do his Thunderstone Grenade. Um, I will toss it at the two guys. They need to make a Constitution save. Which is their worst stat. And what is the save DC for that? It's going to be... Let me see here. Well, they both rolled the same thing, so... Also, it didn't. Uh, didn't a certain member of our party run up to one of them and hit them with a sword? Yes. You know me. Yeah. yeah you also need to make that save. Um. Well, if it's I within have, thirty I'm feet, I could just get him on the cusp of the explosion. Yeah, that's fair. But you are thirty you feet dead. movement speed away. I could. I could just move up. To be fair, he also needs to. Uh. Oh no! Wait. I. It's okay. I'll it's just make just two enemies. Fine. Yeah, it's just two guys. It's just two yeah, enemies. It shouldn't be hard. Yeah. It shouldn't could, be too hard to aim it. Yeah, Gungan <laughs> right. could just take a few steps forward and just chuck it. Yep. Go right ahead. <laughs> All right. It's going to be fourteen. <laughs> okay, they both fail. They are knocked prone and blasted back ten feet. Okay, so they're blasted back to the entrance and. Wait, didn't you throw it behind them? Or to the side. Oh, yeah, I would have thrown it. Oh, yeah, them. no, they would have bl- been blown right in front of you. Ten feet. So, pff, they're on their asses in front of you, basically. Fire in the hold! Oh, too late. <laughs> I will do sound effects. <laughs> Miss the hole! So, roll nice. damage. Watch out for tripping. Oh, no damage. They're just, uh, no damage, it's just yeah. an effect. Yeah, it's just a concussive grenade. Okay, uh, next up, who is next? Okay, it's, uh, bu- 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 wait, did I skip somebody? Oh, sh- crap, I'm sorry, skip Tom. Rabbit. Oh, whoops. <laughs> That's my B. That's fine. You may take your turn now. Alright, for, uh, what is it? Uh, I'm gonna look up at this kobold first as a free action, I'm gonna say... After this, how about you and me go on one of those uh, date things? Uh, roll persuasion. Uh, can I roll charisma? Sure. Right. Oh, good luck. Oh, that's, <laughs> oh, well, so oh, that's, that's a charisma, charisma save. Save. Uh, persuasion, yeah, no, you... persuasion should be charisma, isn't it's it? It's in your stat. Yeah, it's charisma. Right, base. 24. Ooh. Wow, you actually managed to beat her by one point. I'll think about it, she responds, in Draconic. Roll to seduce. <laughs> Alright, then I'm gonna run up to, um, the, uh, guy on the first guy, I guess. And then, mm-hmm. uh, I'm gonna light up my hands and do some shocking grasp with 11. Uh, let me double check uh, their AC. It, he would be prone. He would be prone. So... Yep, and it isn't their turn, so you have advantage, so that'd be a 20... 20- Oh, nice. Nice. Five lightning damage. Nice, nice. (laughs) They just turn into Arnold Schwarzenegger's? Yep, basically. (laughs) Thank you. Okay, uh, is that the end of your turn? Uh, yep. Okay, it's the schmucks turns, and they will take half of their movement to get up, and then... No, I'm, I'm talking about the <laughs> moron. It's all good, I get it. Okay, uh, whoever's right in front of them, which would have been either... Who the heck is in front of them? I mean, I was in front of them initially, but considering they got n- now knocked back behind me... Yeah, technically... Um... I would imagine Gypsy and Storm. 
and May. All right. Well, uh, let's see. Tom, does a fifteen hit your character? Uh, yep, that matches. All right. Second hit. Shit, there goes my dice. Me, I'm clearly helping them. And another fifteen from the other guy. Uh, does that hit you, Storm? Yes, dead on. Okay, uh, let me roll their damage, which is a 1d6 each. Okay, uh, Tom, take four, Storm, take three. Wow! That was nice! No hitting! Alright, uh, it is... <laughs> Uh, the kobold's turn, and she's gonna shoot one of these morons. And that will definitely hit. Let me roll her damage for her bow. Okay, well, that guy's dead. <laughs> Shoots the first guy who's who's shocking with electricity still right through the fucking skull. And he just drops. And uh, she knocks another arrow, ready to shoot again. Uh, she has double attack? Uh, no. She basically reloads with a bonus action. Oh, okay. Uh, next up is... Uh, as the mayor. As the mayor. Back up the list. Alright. Well, what do you want to do? It's just this one guy left. Azamar. Yeah, I'm gonna... Uh, which one was... The one of them is dead, right? Yeah, the guy that got shocked by lightning is dead. Uh, just the other uh, patrol guy. Uh, sure. I'll just then move in on him and do another longsword attack. Uh, 18. That will definitely hit. Sounds good. Uh, 12. Oh, well, he's... Uh, how do you want to kill him? <laughs> um... First, a shield bash across the uh, side of his head, and then mm -hmm. drive the sword in between his uh, throat. Nice, nice. Yeah. You managed to do that with very good finesse, and he drops. Ugh. Wonderful. All right, so that's two of the accorded seven that were reported by the mysterious figure. Gunger rubs his head. He gave me a bonk in. Um. Fall will come out of hiding. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. It's not like you were hit by your own teammate. I'm so. I've never. I've barely used that trick. I don't the know what I'm doing will, in a battlefield. The, the kobold will jump. Uh, okay? Slide down a tree and come up to you, uh, fall and uh, use healing hands on. Uh, you will heal for four. That brings me up to full. She'll just You're give you a, uh, a friend pat. <laughs> I imagine her hand glows radiantly and she just goes, walk it off. <laughs> yeah, basically. And smacks you on the tush. <laughs> Oh my. Oh my! Well, she's short! What do you expect from her? <laughs> you could have said, like, the small of my back or something. I mean, if she can't reach it, she can't reach it. The big- she slapped you on the small of your butt. Sure. Oy vey. Gun Gear- Gun Gear will wander over the glad and just give- give him a- like, a pat on the hip and be like, It's alright, you got this. You just gotta believe in yourself. You gotta believe in your magic magics. And your blasty blasties. Remind me to stay behind you. <sighs> Again, that's why I, well, well, I mean, that's why I should be the one taking point. It wasn't supposed it was just supposed to Oi, devil, the kobold says. My name's Gungio. Galad Morgan. <laughs> They say, what? Morgan. Hi, Morgan. Look, you oh, best you know that this bloody hell of a world is full of 
death and destruction. From what I've seen, but can't speak of, you haven't seen nothing yet. You best better be trained soon. I could have told him that. Uh, and then she does the uh, finger over the uh, throat. That'll get Fall. you killed if you're hesitant. Fall will walk over to her. She's uh, in a tree. <laughs> oh, well, so Fall will be near her. Uh, Morgan, was it? Aye. If you don't mind me asking, you have wings. I've never <laughs> seen a cobalt with wings. It's a rare trait. It's sort of a common occurrence. Cut cut out. Out. Ah, god damn it. Hold on a minute. Do, do, do. Alright, am I good? Yeah. For now, yeah. Yeah. Alright, good. Rare occurrence. It's a rare occurrence around these parts, but I'm kind of one of the last of references to her scale color. This color. I see. But, regardless, I do what I'm told by nudges her head again back towards town. The boss. Everyone's gonna make a living. Mm. Nods. But she's a friend, so I owe her that much. It's always good to have friends. How noble of you. Mm. Uh... See if the, one of those morons points the corpses in. Uh, I'll keep cover fire. You cut out again. God damn it. Just the first Check part. if one of these morons. That's what. That was the last thing we heard. Venom. I think he's getting back that in the chat. Y'all. 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 Yo. Hello. Am I good? A little spotty. Hello. Yeah, a little spotty. Alright, sorry about that. Check if one of these morons... Check if one of these morons has a key, get your asses in there, I'll provide cover fire. Uh... Gungi will start to shoot your pockets. I'll start rummaging around on... Uh, I'm gonna pull the arrow I, the first one. I will, uh... Walk towards the house and kind of, like, peek in any windows to see if anybody's there. Oh no. Oh no, that's a natural one. Would I use What do I roll? Or... Uh, if you're gonna be looking in... Oh god, you cut out again. Mm. Uh, god damn it. I, I swear if to lord. If you're gonna be looking, just tell me. Okay, I'll, I'll just type it. Come on. I think you need to sometimes get a new mic or something. I mean, sometimes it's just the connection. Yeah, his mic sounds like it's fine. It just sounds like the internet connection right now. That's alright. We can just work on it later. Yeah, I will need a new mic later on. I'll, I'll buy a new one. <laughs> okay, uh... Did you post something, or...? No, he's typing, typing it in, uh, in. in chat. Oh, okay. Perception if... Okay. Looking, looking in the camera, all right. Perception... I can type it, I swear. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no, double that one. Ah, six. <laughs> That's kidding. six. Jesus Christ. All my practical skills suck today. <laughs> <laughs> my combat yeah. rolls are great. <laughs> Wow, Jesus. Um, let's see, so... I imagine you... now... Okay, can I honestly say what I think what happens? Sure. I honestly think what happens... My character's, like, common sense doesn't come to him, and he just starts knocking on the door. Is anybody home? Well, let's not put words in the DM's mouth. 
<laughs> you did this. Thank you for giving me ideas. Or just never mind. Okay, um... <laughs> You, you 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 see the door open, and a, a head poke out. I'm gonna roll them perception check with disadvantage since they literally just woke up. That's a natural one. Your internet is really bad right now. You said that was a natural uh, one. No, I heard what you said. It's just that you were roboting. Oh, uh, I can't really do anything about that. Sorry. Am I good now? Yeah. Not bad. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, so the guy looks around like, the fuck? He says, looking around, Joe, Frank, you guys out there? No response. He walks out holding his javelin, rubbing his eyes. You have an opportunity attack. Okay. If you wish to I will take one. Uh, shh. That would be see. both you and Azamar. Um, I guess I will. Uh, yeah, I'll just use my bread and butter longsword attack. It's uh, 16. Okay, and I, I will. I will rail frost. Hit. I will rail frost this guy. Okay. Seven, uh, 11 damage. Yep. Seven. Oh, wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be uh, 13 damage? 11 plus 2 slashing? Uh, it's because of the crit. Oh, oh. I'll be right back. Yeah, if I had the... Um, yeah. The, uh, bru if he had... A crit. Yep. Anywho. Um, yep, you damage him heftily. He's like, whoa, what the hell? And he turns... I wildly throws his javelin with disadvantage. I ray frost him. Yeah, I know. He took I don't think uh, a seven. Oh, hits. you didn't hit. You you didn't hit. Sorry. I just now imagine I made a little snowman in the ground. Yeah. You I guess uh, he completely misses um, with the javelin, and now he's weaponless. I he's like, oh shit. And holds up his fists. I he give a the uh, bottom of initiative. I, I hold I hold my hand up against Fall, saying he's unarmed. Now okay, but him. I give a before that I gave like a small coil and I went, uh, do you want to build a snowman? Ha! <laughs> Roll persuasion. Because <laughs> <laughs> this guy just literally woke up. <laughs> Seven. Seventeen. All right. No, it's only one of you. That's me, cause I'm the one who said it. Uh, no, he beats you out. He's like, no. Oh, I was rolling. Yeah, he takes over your <laughs> snowman. I was rolling persuasion for him to assess. Not get a, no. Well, I was gonna ask if he doesn't want to get eviscerated, he better start talking. Okay. Uh, I will. Reroll his uh, inside. Okay. Yeah, there goes my dice. Wow, pulling multiple Monty's in a day. That's a four. He's like, all right, all right, I'll talk. He holds up his hands. We're looking for. What, what do you I... want to know? I tell him that we're looking for the sword that this quest is for. Um. I think the boss may have a more unique sword that he stole from poor Wanderer like a couple days ago. Uh, that's all I know. We were told not to touch it. I'm just following orders, man. Uh, does he state where the uh, boss may be within the complex? In his tent, probably. It's, it's straight back if you go through the doors. Well, thank you for your service. And I attempt to knock him out with my shield. Uh, I guess roll a straight strength check? Okay. And I'll roll him constitution, I guess. Uh, 15. Oh, pff, yeah, no, he, he beats you out with an 18. Oh, I really? will... 
I'll try to knock him out with my quarter staff. Bunk, bunk, All right, bunk, roll, bunk, bunk, roll bunk, strength. Bunk. No, deck I actually, I, I'll just do some do damage. Okay. That's gonna kill him. You soft roll the hit. No, it's yeah. a soft. It's subdue damage. Oh, yeah, not me. It's not only to point. knock him out. You, you still have to roll, by the way. Ten. Yep, that will hit. Really? <laughs> yeah. Bonk! They, they have really... They're unarmored schmucks, and they're okay. human. Or. Yeah. He didn't... You know, with what damage he took earlier, he, he was pretty low, so... Over the head. Is out. Bonk. And the door is open. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, Gungir is still uh, searching the bodies. You found the key, by the way. Okay. Excellent. And he'll he'll be chatting up with Ravik. What sort of date do you think you take kobolds on? Do you take them on like little kobold dates, or what? What do you do? Oy vey. <laughs> I don't know. I've never actually done it before. Oh, so this is new for you. Yeah. Well, I could be your wingman. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I think we should just get moving for now. Yeah, we could talk about details later. We should get you a nice hat for that date. A bigger skull cap. Again. Again, I'm shaking you're asking my head. random idiots. You're asking random idiots to play D and D. Hmm. Yeah, I, I half expected this. This is almost as this is worse than, to be honest. <laughs> worse than what? Takahata one hundred one, a uh, different D and D group. Oh yeah, Gyps. yeah. Hmm. We know about. Anywho, yeah, I think so you, okay. I think Gary is the only one who doesn't know about unexpected. Oh, you're roboting, fall. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you're oh, cutting yeah. out hard, man. Galad, look! Oh, I got a key. That must mean there's a lock somewhere ah. that doesn't have its key. Jesus and that's Christ. the kind of lock we need to open to retrieve the treasure. Hello? I love treasure. Yep, Hi, fall. Welcome back. Cool. This All is right. it. Do you think it's like sure? Come on, let's go. So what happened? Nothing much. Uh, they were they were just discussing that uh, they found a key on one of the corpses. Ah. Uh, uh, eh. uh, tree or er, ah, fall. Uh points that the door is slightly open. Yep. The guy did come out. It is open. And he also points to the unconscious body. Yep. Actually, I have an idea. I am going to do? try to take a any weapons these guys might have. He threw his only javelin. You basically retrieved the javelins. I meant the other guys. Or wait, are they also dead? Yeah, they're dead. The other two are dead. Okay, this never mind. Never mind. Uh, when we get in, I will try to take their weapons. Okay, so you managed to retrieve all three javelins. Gungir will wander inside the building with his, all right. with his well, key held up. It, it's just a wall. It's a oh. it's a wood wall. It's like one of those tree walls, basically. Oh, like a like a big old wooden barricade. Basically. Okay. Gungir will not wander into. <laughs> he will poke his head in and see if he can... uh. Roll perception. Oh no! Wait, wait! I was saying I entered and I was trying to take the guys who were still sleeping weapons. Oh, um, you can't tell if any, you can't really see inside of the other, like, as I said, the two guys that you already killed are dead. The one guy was unconscious and you managed to only recover their weapons. Eh, better than nothing. 
Uh, you do... What do I see with my Gungirian eyes? You see five tents and a small, like, I guess stable where there's, like, pigs and roosters, pigs. like, trapped in. All right, looks like a pretty basic camp. They got five tents and they got a stable with piggies and roosters. Mm-hmm. All right, so you're walking, basically, from here? There's nobody, uh, like, outside that you see. Um, hold on, do I have a backpack on me? You should have... Like, yes, I no, do! Uh, yeah, yeah, you should. Yeah. Okay, I am going to Maychan some of those tents. Uh, they're like big ones. You can't really. Oh, oh! I thought you said they were rolled up. No, 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 no. They're, no. They're, like up. they're they're big suckers that are bolted down. Okay, never mind. I thought you were talking about like roll up tents. Nope. These are like big sleeping in tents, Mister Fall. So, like, if you're having like a big old forest party and you want to have a big old sleepover in the forest. Of a permanent encampment of sorts. Yeah. I retconned that because I thought they were. In camp. Something yeah. Else. No worries. Alright, uh, so you waddle in, basically. Yeah, Gungir waddles in. He loves camps. Uh. Waddle, waddle, waddle. I will follow in. From behind. Actually, no. I'll. T I'll. Open the door a bit more and gesture for, for uh, oh, uh, glad to come in for, after you. Oh, already some backstabbery. I'm loving this. <laughs> Anyhow, this is how party so you... members get killed. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> to keep it simple. So you want to win. You know, you see the the first two tents empty when you look inside of them, like their flaps are open. Next to, as you walk up to them, they're closed, and the one at the far end is closed. What's in? You said that the first two are empty. Are there like any personal supplies in there, or just just like completely abandoned? You see bed rolls and like maybe. And what was that? Bed rolls, basically sleeping bags, and yeah. uh. You cut out at that last word. Uh, side tables. Oh, side tables. What's on the side tables? What are the Candles side tables and daggers. Huh. Like one on each and one dagger. Okay. Let's see here. Eh, nothing, nothing really. Gungir could use. Uh, eh, he could probably use it. All kinds of uses. Gungir will go and take one dagger. All right. So you retrieve one common steel dagger. Well, I got a choppy chop. Well, I can use this to cut cheese. <laughs> Basically, have a cheese or butter knife. <laughs> switch, 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 switch. Blade. I use I use mine to pick my teeth. Boy, bay. Anywho, slash, slash. what do you want to do about the other two that the other three that are close? Should we pop in and say hi? This I will leave to the party. What, I mean, like, what's I, going I, I, on? Hurt You're deciding what to do. We got. Two. What's your choices? We don't want uh, to. You can kill some folks. Basically, surprise attack the any of the three, or release the animals and cause havoc. I'd say release the animals, but some of us hide. Unfortunately, not all of us are very good at stealth. I know my character isn't. So. Yeah, that's why you. When I'm uh, out hold on, hold on. on branches, I'm good at it. That's why you guys want one circle hall. It's a stampede. Well, I love stampedes. It's like a parade that's not organized. 
while the more ranged people hide out. Well, I volunteer to release the piggies. I'm with you. Yeah, you want to release- Let's cause a distraction. You want to release piggies too? Come on, come I on, Glad. Let's go release piggies? some piggies. All the boars. All I'm of them. I'm gonna roll stealth to hide. All right, go right ahead. Damn, yep. that's really nice. All right, anyone else want to stealth? You got to get into position. We're going to release the roosters. Now, give it a shot. The most vicious. I don't, I don't want to roll any okay. die. What about our go. archer girl? She's in the trees. I don't really need to roll for She's fine. I'll just say that. Mm. Uh, that everybody that wanted to stealth? That just leaves, uh, uh, what was Ravik doing? Uh, I'm gonna try to go up on one of these guys. As soon like, as they come out? Them. Hmm? As soon as they come out, right? Yeah. Okay, so you're gonna basically hold an action. Gotcha. Yes. Alright, uh, which tents do you want to, uh, camp out at? One, two, or three? Uh, I'll go with two. I'll take one. Uh... I'm going to roll to hear, like, which one is probably the loudest. They're all sleeping. Yeah. But we don't know how many is in which. Okay, so, Asmar, which one did you want to take? One. One? Okay. Alright. Um, as you walk up you kind of well, boars and dire chickens? Wow, the most fearsome of all <laughs> chickens. They're it's like big. a chocobo. They're like chickens, but dire. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're bigger. They're as big as Ravak and Morgan. Hmm. Kobold sized chickens. Could you imagine the yep. omelets they lay? It'd be a big <laughs> omelet. Yes, I hear you, I'm Mr. Chicken. Something. It tries to peck you. Does a 16 hit you? Yes. <laughs> no! No, jump the head! <laughs> Max damage! Oh, oh, no. How much damage? Uh, six piercing damage Ow. through your hand. <laughs> Gun Gear's down to one HP right now. <laughs> Gun Gear's... This is really why bad. our team is so unbalanced. Gun Gear is gonna... Reach into his little satchel and pull out a uh, healing drought. Let's All right. See here. Roll that. It's gonna be uh, 1d8. Okay. And... I tried to make my character tanky so that eight. Oh, nice. They'd have something okay. to focus on, and I haven't been hit this whole game. <laughs> Gun gear. I mean, right. it's the rolls. So that brings him up to nine. Okay. So that's I mean, Tom is also a tank. That's a bad chicken. We don't go pecking gun gears. You're not meant for pecking. It narrows its own little... Alright. Gun gear's gonna look up at Glad. You wanna you wanna get the chickens, I'll get the piggies? These chickens They're are... in the same pattern. Wow! You put two okay. nefarious creatures together. Let's You'll never know what'll do happen. It together. Right. Let's do it together. Alright. Love doing things Roll together. Roll slide a hand. Going to. On. One of you with damage. Is your assisting? Whoever has the higher modifier. Go. Roll with advantage. That's a twelve. Let me see how Sorry. good this really crap. All right. Wait, I had a plus There's three. With a seven, that passes. So you break the crappy made woodlock, latch it open, and the dire chickens and the boars start stampeding through the camp. All around you guys. Be free! Causing mass havoc. And the 
all the people now wake up and come outside. There are three guys that come out. You see a big, burly man with a great axe, and two human guys with uh, long swords. Chaos, chaos, chaos! I'll be right back. Alright, and those of you who wanted to take an opportunity to do that now. Alright, so... Am I in front of one of them? Shit. You're like right next to them. Alright. Ooh, that's very nice. That will definitely hit. Oh. Oh. (laughs) When you remember it's a weak attack. (laughs) How could you do this to me? Mm-hmm. It's like the little, it's like the little toy buzzers. <laughs> like a prank on someone. All right. Um. Let's see. Who else held an action? Uh, Azamar. I did. I rolled a twelve. Well, oh, I didn't see that. You do hit. Oh shit! Cool. I mean, I was just hiding. Nine damage. Yep. Minus nine to I that guy. Just so you guys know, in your character sheet, there's like core, bio spells, and a gear. If you click the gear, there's a place where you can set it to not always roll with advantage. I'd rather have you the advantage the because sometimes advantage. I give it. Depends, though. Yeah. It's just. Uh, well, I've got to set to query. Each time on. I roll, it asks me, do you have advantage? Well, yeah, that's why I keep it all. I, I don't have that feature off. It's annoying. I mean, there's just some instances where you like forget that they're prone or something like that. Mm-hmm. And Morgan also had a held act. I'm gonna roll for her. That is a natural twenty. Go, girl. Jesus. Roll that damage. Okay. I guess since I was hiding, I'll also do a roll if that's allowed. All right. Actually, no, since you chose to hide, you do not, and you didn't specificize it. Okay. Okay, so the one from Tent 1 is dead, with an arrow through the throat. Mm-hmm. And Asking now cool. it Taking is... Taking my kill? Yep, pretty much. Alas, poor York, killed by a steel piece. Kill stealing punk. All right, uh, it is now <laughs> Azimer's turn. We're still following the same initiative, by the way. Sure. Um, I just imagine so the... he runs up to go slice this guy in half, and an arrow plugs <laughs> plugs his kill. He's just like, well, he got Hit. the first swing, and then arrow kill. Yeah, it was kill steal. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> so you got the other guy and the big boy. <laughs> Uh, I'll make my way over by. Is the man with the great axe within 30 feet? Yes, he is. Alright, I will move in and engage him. Alright. Roll to hit, I suppose. I'm going to also invoke uh, Crimson Right. Alright. Explain what that is to. Sure. Or at least click the thing. Sorry, Whoa. it's really kind of long. That is long, Jesus. Invoke the red of blood. Choose one right. You learn. That's right. He's enchanting his sword with uh, elemental damage. An extra one d four damage. Okay. Yep. And it, uh, as long as it's active, I have one less hit point because I'm level one. Yep, that's fine. Uh, and then because that was a bonus action. I will just be attack, and I'll be invoking it onto my and then striking. Oh yeah! Yep, nice. that will definitely hit. Oh hell yeah! All right, the eleven slashing damage, and then the one d four. Oh, I uh, just click it. Yep, my bad. Oh, yeah, max four. damage. Hey, four nice. damage. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. All right, he does not look okay. Uh, it is now Grungear's turn. Uh, let me see here. Um, 
Gungir is going to reach into his satchel and pull out another, uh, another Thunderstone grenade. Or another concussion grenade. He's going to chuck it right behind... Yeet it. <laughs> He's going to chuck it right behind, uh, the big guy. So that it doesn't catch Azzy, but it just catches the big guy. So he has to roll a constitution save. Okay. Where am I, by the way? Um, are you going to be... Well, okay. This... What was that? Considering... Uh, I, I'll, I'll get to you in a minute, Kit. Um, okay, since you're technically... You have the throwing range. Yeah. However, to get it out of that radius, either you're taking the hit or as he's taking the hit. Or if you're angling it a little bit further, I believe, if I'm mathing this correctly, leave who the heck is it? Uh, Tom is in reach. So it's what, you choose basically who gets Okay. At um, that point. Ah, shoot. Uh, I, can, I should be able to take it. I have a plus seven to my constitution. Okay, okay. Um... Yeah, you're going to hear Gun Gear scream, FIRE IN YOUR HOLE! And he goes and he chucks his little grenade. Um, he's going to try to angle it so it catches the big guy. And um, he's going to regret this, but maybe uh, Azzy within the blast radius. Ah, oh, shit! Alright, All right, so the DC was... Uh, 14. Yep, the big guy passes with a... Oh, shit. Say, uh, so he's... As he's knocked back... Uh, and prone. Ten, ten feet. Ten feet and prone. Well, I mean, he still needs a 19 to hit me. Yep. Well, he gets advantage, though, if he does manage... Sorry, as he... <sighs> Alright, uh, now it is... I imagine that as he didn't hear you because his ears are ringing. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, that's to be fair. Uh, it is Best now, combat. Tom, your turn. Uh, who's the guy I hit with that nat 20? Is it, the, is it the same big guy, or is it another guy? It was another guy. It was uh, the other guy that came out of... And he's still up, I assume, right? Yup. He's fine. Uh, first, I'm gonna try to say, if you want to live, you could... Or I could shock you again. Your choice. Roll persuasion. Persuasion or, or intimidation? Roll intimidation of choice. And I'll roll insight. Oh, they're both the oh, same. Good so. luck. 23. Ooh. Oh, oh wow. damn. <laughs> yeah, that beats that 17 that I just rolled. Oh. Yeah, you like good. that? You saw what I did to your kneecap? I'll do it again. <laughs> uh, and he just dives into the uh, as a free action this guy uh, jumps into uh, the tent and hides you see the tent actually physically shaking <laughs> it's an orc by the way that you intimidated jeez oh, <laughs> uh, you sucker up there zap my kneecaps does that count right, as an now, action it's her. No, I will say that's a free action, and I will not include this guy since he's too scared out of his mind. All right, then I'm gonna move up to the big guy, and I'm gonna try shocking him. Okay. Go ahead. Good. Oh, Have fun. Twelve. Ah, mm. uh, that just misses. Oh. Okay. You whenever you do and you were like, eh. Honestly, no. honestly, the uh, I just imagine it's the episode of Ed and Eddie where Ed is the scene of Ed and oh, Eddie where you Ed are just, Kit, you're cut you're out like so high hack. Hmm. And I get the reference. Anywho, uh, on to Jack, fall. Jack. You're good. Jack. Fall, you're up. You're good. How's my sound? Oh, God. Yeah, still robotic. Better? Uh, 
I just I'm gonna reset my router again. I think I think it's good now. I think. Okay, he's just gonna type uh, his stuff in. Uses Ray okay. Frost. Okay. Yep, Ray Frost. At boss man. On um, closest enemy. At okay. boss man. Yeah. Basically. All to hit. Nat oh, it's natural 20. twenty. That'll definitely nice. hit. That makes up for that internet. <laughs> okay, that is Ooh. eleven damage. Wow, he has one HP. Hello, hello. You're back. You're good. Oh God, hi. Okay. Okay, he is not looking so hot. It is now Grumpy Gear. Uh, oh, did we did we skip Galad? No, I I jumped yeah, out of the. What happened to my turn? I. Uh, wait. Gallant? Oh, wait. Oh, nope, I did during my him. turn. During my turn, I jump. I jump out of the tent. Out of hiding. And just yell, "Blizzard!" Okay. Uh, Gallant, I actually did skip you. That's my be. Uh, I I I don't have initiative order in order to set uh, numbers. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I wondered. I wondered if you started in the middle of the initiative or something. I was like, "No, I started maybe, from beginning." He's gonna loop it's back like, around I to me. Give to you. Okay, that, that's my B. I, I I'll have to set up. Okay. Um. So all I noticed that my friend got knocked back, and no, prone, so I yeah. put myself in between the boss and him. I'll mm -hmm. rush up to him with my long sword, brandishing it. And I will um, activate. Well, I guess I know he has. Uh, he, if I didn't know he had one hit point, I would have used something else. Instead, I'll just. Uh, I'm going to use Booming Blade. All right. I'm going to cast. Come on, come on. All and right. What well, action? Well, making a melee attack against him. Basically, right, and he has him. to make. Yeah, he just has to make a save, correct? Um, you make no save attack. at all. Yeah, okay, no so save. You just nope. If if he tries to move, he will take bonus damage. Okay, for this attack. but she's not I'm, moving. I, I, he I, just I, I got am... out here. Yeah, well, all well, right, I'm trying to keep him from getting to my prone friend. All right, I appreciate your efforts. So I'm going to make a melee attack. Go ahead. If you hit, that is. Uh, that just hits! Yay! <laughs> Hit, and uh, that will do. Input value. How do I... You just roll I 1d10 that, plus damage. Yeah, plus your strength. Roll 1d10, then roll uh, an extra 1d8. To be honest. <laughs> 1d10 plus... Stern. Plus an extra d8, you said? Yeah, cause, uh, wait. According to your spell, it Oops. says... If it if the target moves before then... They oh, never mind. Move. But regardless, so, you roll yeah. a 3, so it doesn't matter. There we go. There. Oh, never mind. We're good. So, how do you want to so kill I this man? <laughs> Always a good thing. Uh, um... So I'll rush up and I'll say, "You're not gonna move from that spot!" And I go to stab him in the leg, but I swing too hard and I just slice his legs clean off. Oh Jesus! Nice. <laughs> it just topples over. <laughs> that happens. Like, just... like, like I was like, Ugh. I was like, I'm gonna ha I'll hamstring him so he can't move. <laughs> and I just cut do. his leg off. <laughs> And he just flops forward, like you know. Oh wait a minute! If he got sliced with the over. legs, I just imagine Glad now does the D dub or uh, double D oh dear or oh my. Yeah, he flops on you oh, now. <laughs> he if, just flops. Uh, 
Speaking uh, from a medical point of view, if he sliced oh. him through the legs, this death would be him, like, gushing out blood from his stumps. <laughs> this is... yeah, there are a lot of major arteries too. down there. <laughs> you know, so basically... <laughs> falls on top of, uh... Poor Gallad. Oh no! As he's dead. <laughs> uh, now you're under his massive frame. Good luck lifting uh, 100 pounds. <laughs> he crushed Gally. I'm gonna try to. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean, the 15. I mean, I'm trying to. I mean, an average character can, can lift uh, 150. Uh, yep, you managed to just uh, roll him off you. Whoa, he's alive. I Hi, mean, a I'm I okay. Mean, I um, killed a guy. I've never killed a man. Well, oh, congratulations. He died. Well, congratulations on in. your first. I stay. Uh, I stand up and brush myself off and say, "Well, it's not it's essentially that you just killed a man, but you've also saved a friend. So I appreciate that." <sighs> Morgan so, will just, nod. It's all about things. I'm sure I saw you go flying and. One person at a time, please. I'm sorry for the hand grenade, oh, it was very good. <laughs> It's alright. Well, Anywho, you did good, kid. Morgan grenade? will slap your leg and gallad. Oh, hey, thanks. <laughs> well, you know, the, the world's a hard and a dangerous place. <laughs> Stuff. <laughs> She'll roll her eyes. All right, let's grab the blade and let's get. Gungir will uh want. Actually, are the animals still stampeding? Uh, no, they basically bolted out. <laughs> They're gone. Bye, Gungir. We Willa. freed a bunch of animals. We're heroes, Gungir. Yeah, well, I'm a hero. Now it's time somewhere to in the far distance, animals. there are hunters. Oh. Now it's time to go raid this guy's tent. Gungir will and wander those animals will probably shit, cause some destruction. Morgan will shrug. Look, they're not that dangerous, considering that. I beg to differ. Oh, really? He took one of. He took tried. one of Gungir's exploding crystal things. Just shrugged it right off. Mm-hmm. Sure. She'll roll her eyes and all right, <laughs> let's let's loot this man and whatever crap he had. Gungir will uh wander into his What's tent. Okay. Roll uh, perception. I'll wander, yeah, into, into, I'll wander into the tent with a quivering man. Okay. You you'll grab the guy that you scared shitless. Uh, I'll use the perception roll. No, uh, to get the bot loot the bodies. Tom scared him shitless. I'm checking okay. to see if uh, there's like any items there. Uh, like on um, on whose body? No, in the tent. Oh, on yeah. that guy, in that guy's tent, or just in in the tent itself, in that guy's tent. Okay, the one that was scared shitless. Uh, besides the same sort of setup, crappy as on him. Not, not much. Okay. Okay. Same setup, basically. Uh, What's... Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Was it Grungear, you... S Wait, what? Oh, I was just going to ask, was it investigation or perception? Uh, perception. Perception, okay. Uh, you you and uh, Azamar see... I'm looting A rather bodies. large chest uh, in the... Boss man's quarters. Huh. Gungio's gonna wander on up to it. Everyone being robot really hard. Oh shoot! Sure. Thanks. Thanks for the tip. Hopefully, I'm better. Yeah. Let me Did it clear up, or is it still going, Tom? Uh, it sounds a little bit better now. Am I coming in better? Yeah. Okay. Am I good? Yeah. 
Right. Okay, cool. Hmm. Might be just Discord today. Mm-hmm. And weird all week. Hmm. Anywho. I'll try to get a Ravix attention to loot the chest. Because the sword's probably in there. Yeah, Gungir. There's a chest. Gungir was going to check it for traps yep. real quick. There is a chest got, in the uh, boss man's chambers. Tools. Okay, uh... Gungir holds so, with them. So there... I'm going to see the chest, and I'm going to go... Wait. I will mage hand the chest. Okay. So and you try do. to open it. It's locked. Okay. Exactly why we need Ravik to take care of this. Can I, I more want to make sure... I more want to make sure it was something else. It wasn't something else. Eh. No, I'm not that evil. What, what do you mean? What, el- what else would it be? Ever it heard like of a chest. A, ever heard of a mimic? Ever heard of a mimic? Let me see here. <laughs> Anyone else see what I mean? Not that type of mimic, <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> Wrong. Sorry, no. I thought I was a being mi- funny. A mimic... It's a creature that disguised itself as a treasure chest. I'm or well anything, that, really. But... <gasps> and you're sure it's not one of those things? I poke it with my sword. No, I touched no it with my... No, I use my mage hand to right. make it sure. Gungir will... If it well... was, it would have... It would have tried eating it. Gungir... I try to open it, and it's not... Gungir right. will take a seat right in front of the lock, and he'll pull out his uh, thieves' tools. Out of character, I would imagine uh, he would know what a mimic is because of the sorcerer school that he went to. Yep. I'll uh, aid you on that, uh, so that you have an advantage. Well, it doesn't oh, matter. That's an eight. <laughs> Why do the Kay. thieving tools... You basically use your lockpick, and... It- Damn, Simple what, as that. What happens? You you use your you you just break the your lockpick. No, no. Oh no! Oh no! Wrong. Hold on, scooch over, scooch, scooch. Let me well, try. I'm scooting, I'm scooting. Give me a second. <laughs> Jesus Let me Christ! See. You did it wrong. You Jimmy did when you needed to jammy it. Oh, I was jamming all oh, the time. Venom, I don't don't jimmy when you need to jammy. I was jamming. Oh, Venom, I never DM'd fiddled you. with a lock in your life, have you? All right, well, I'll, 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 I'll check it out. I'll... What? One moment, the four four. Uh, so if you're gonna attempt to lockpick, uh, either use thieves tools or slide ahead. Jeez, not bad. We can't Jesus, roll. Jesus, these rolls. Is it so? I'm going to check if any of the bodies have keys on them. Okay. Uh, roll investigation. Fall. Your dice are cursed. Mm, <laughs> I got Gun- switch. Gungir tries to key that. Investigation. Oh, Gungir okay. will... Gungir 18! Will... Not bad. Okay. You managed to find uh, a key on the... Uh, key on the boss... Uh, allow me, belt. Allow, allow me. I walk over to the chest and unlock it with the key. But I've, got, I, I've just got to jimmy a little more. Well, no, you uh, can't maybe be. Maybe I have to jimmy it. You can't be jimmy. You've got to jimmy it. it. I didn't. I didn't want to jimmy it though. Guy, I unlocked. I unlocked it. Yeah, y- yeah, you what? did. Hold on, Fall. We're having a conversation oh. between men. This is a manly argument. Um, oh, okay, Morgan's going to slide all you of upside the head. As you say, I pull out the key, put it in. Ow! Ow! What was that for? What? No, Morgan no. says simply, no. focus, he no, found no, the key. No. no, I was saying, as you guys were talking, I'm... I like to get you away from the chest, and I, and I unlock it. You're roboting really hard, kid. Oh my god. 
Like, I understood you, but it was bad. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we uh, we heard you unlocking it, and um, and Gungir was like, you see that? He was Jim he was jimming while you were jimmying. <laughs> <laughs> and then Morgan slaps both of you for being... <laughs> saying that you fall found the key and unlocked the chest. Right. There were many ways to unlock a chest. Well, Sometimes you fidget with the lock. Key's Sometimes the easy way. Sometimes you use Oy the crowbar man. that you have in your backpack. Is the sword inside the chest? You see a very elaborate... Um, I actually prepared an image for this because I didn't think... Yeah, yeah, shoot me that image. But the blade... Oh, well, I, I don't have the image actually up. I'd have to... The and upload it to found items or found documents, I should say. Okay. If you guys don't mind waiting for a little bit, that is. Yeah, I guess that's fine. We could take a little bit of a break while uploading. Yep. Take a quick bio break if you guys need to. I. And stream I'm actually going to reset see. my router. Yeah, you might as well do that. It's bad. It, it's real bad now. Yeah. And I might have to uh, call it quits in not too long because I do have to work in the morning. And it's about... It's almost 11.30 over here. Agreed. Yeah. Uh, I say... Long, yeah. But... yeah, I was like... Because <sighs> uh, I, I also have to work tomorrow as well. So, after we get back to town, I will say we will call the session there. Works Come on, me. Google load. And then we can use... Was there anything else in the chest besides the sword? Uh, there's some other miscellaneous weapons. Pretty crappy ones, but nothing as exquisite as this. And you managed to find, like, a uh, flat 200 gold. Ooh, nice. Did this guy have, like, split a... Among you. Does this guy have, like, a desk or anything? Not really. I mean, side table, but that's, like, it. Give me a little bit to find the blade, because it is being a butt. Because my computer is taking 50 trillion years to load. I am sorry to hear that. It is fine. Hello. Okay. Hello. Ow. There was a download going on. Oh. That makes sense. <laughs> that sucks. That really does. Hello. Shalom. Come on. My, my internet sucks so much that a single download uses quite oh. a lot. Oh, it's They're doing it again. God, it's awful. We can now. tell. Again? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we it's can freaking turn off the demo. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to re reconnect again. We a they. Thankfully, I will cut it soon. I just fa finished finding the. Chat got to see my side of the stream for a little bit. Give me one moment. See, so found documents. Add handout. Give me a moment because this thing is being a royal pain in my ass. Eh. Come on. I know how you feel. When I was running Monster Madness with these guys, I was trying to bring up a picture on there and just would not cooperate. Yeah. Uh, put all my dice away. A while. Come on. Well, that, that kind of worked. If all else fails, you can always load it into uh, the Discord. The uh, Yeah, the Discord chat, and we can take a look at it. Just for right now. Yeah. 
Yeah, give me give me a hot second. I literally just just a hot second. The yes. hot second of your life. So hot they call it a volcano second. <laughs> so hot that Pornhub doesn't even allow this second on its side. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Please stop before Twitch kills us. Alright, I need to find this thing now. There it is. There's the thing. Hopefully it loads quickly. He has the thing. He is loading up the thing. Ah, oh, fashion. Save changes. Do done. That is the blade. Oh no, somebody put a big old circle on this sword. And that is what you see. So I'm gonna close the image for my side of the <laughs> Cause Jesus Christ loading is on And uh who wants to go pick up the blade? Well If you guys wanna give me one second, right, I can I can cast identify. Well, I can I can learn its secrets. Sure, here. Cast Identify on this, and I pick it up to hand it to him. Uh, roll strength saving throw. You, <laughs> you got it. <laughs> uh. And it begins. Uh. Oh, oh, four. Nope! <laughs> as soon as you go to... On the ground. Cut out. I I Mike right now. Am I good? You're better. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. So you pull out the blade. As soon as it leaves the chest and enters, like you know, a, a space, it immediately weighs a ton. You instantly drop it with a tong, a loud tong on the ground. Oh, uh, I didn't. Wait, hold on. I try to pick it up off the ground. Roll strength save. Again. Hands. Oh, good luck. Pick it up, lift, lift with the legs. <laughs> <laughs> Nope. Hello. I got. I got. I just gotta. Go. Nope. I fall back on check, my butt. Check. Check. One, two, three. You're good. You're good. You're, you're good, Kit. Welcome back. Okay. Cool. Glad what you, you... did I miss? Between uh, the two, they, we found the blade, uh, which is in player's notes under the name Falshin. Uh, if you want to pull up that image, when did you really just uh, take uh, out the the freaking fire emblem weapon? Yeah, basically. Is there any magical properties that I can sense from it? Ah, uh, yes. Lots of holy yeah. radiant energy. Uh, for some reason, I can't pick it up. Seeing that Ravik's having some problems, I'll try and pick it up. Oh, no, not me. Uh, you see... I didn't try yet. With a... By the, 13. By the way, the fact that this has, like, some... Magic quality to it. You see, trees eyes light up with this almost nope. blue kind of blue kind of light. Huh. Mm -hmm. Gun Gungir will uh, kind of waddle up to the sword. He's not gonna pick it up. He's gonna see these guys having trouble with it. He's just gonna plop him his little self down and start casting his spelly spell. And he's gonna do identify. Or ritual cast identify. All right. Okay. Guys, you're going about this all wrong. You gotta start by saying hello, sword. How are you today? You gotta get the notes first. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Mm. <laughs> also, so, uh, oh, I see. I see. Galahad's taking notes. I see. I see. How are you, sword? How are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. Okay. Uh -huh. can't, uh -huh. uh, please say what you were going to say before I, I lose going... my mind. I was gonna say, uh, Fall is also, like, 
purring very loudly, tail swishing back and forth as he just looks at his sword. Alright, so basically, what you... You cut yeah, out again. that's how long... Oh my god! I'm going to slaughter in Discord today by the end of this. Am I good? For now, yeah. Yeah. Jesus Christ, Discord's awful tonight. All right. From what you under get from the 10 minute ritual after that, because, you know, rituals take that long, uh, is that it's a holy weapon that is supposed to be wielded by, well, people of namely royalty, and only those that are worthy can pick it up. All right, Gungir will uh, Gungir will nod his head and thank the sword for all that information, and he's going to get up and look at everyone. All right, good news and bad news. The bad news is I don't think any of us can touch it unless, well, you know, we got royalty. I don't got <laughs> well, any. I guess that counts me out. Well, I don't got any royalty bound... on me. A sword bound to a type of person. Interesting. Purring intensifies. And by the way, this is a very loud purr. You guys can be able to hear this without perception. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Morgan will walk up. Alright, since none of you jabberwocks can touch the damn thing, she's going to lean down. Thankfully, she flashes the holy symbol for like two seconds and puts it back under her little breastplate. And uh, picks up the sword with no issue. Hmm. Also, it works with religious people. Well, I forgot to mention. only <sighs> this specific religious symbol. Her religion, mostly. Well, yeah, if she flashes the symbol of the religious dragons. Can one... I roll to know what religious symbol that is? Yes, if you uh, wish. I'm going to try as well. Religion. Huh. Religion, yes. 14. And... All right. Natural yeah. 20. Yeah. 12. Okay. So, Fall, you've heard of this religion. It's religion of physical beauty. Oh, my fucking lord. Uh, uh, I hate Discord. Please kill it with fire. Discord usually isn't this bad. It's better than I Skype. don't. Yeah, I'll give you that. But regardless, I'm just gonna keep Discord up because honestly, I think it's because I keep minimizing hey, it or whatever. Hold on, hold on. Try, try uh leaving Discord and coming back. It'll take a while to reboot. I'm just gonna say that the, my be, thing likes to be an. That's fine. We can wait. All right, I'll be back. If you guys are okay with that. Guys? Yeah, I'm still here. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's... Okay. So I'll wait for Venom to get back. So um, who picked up the sword, by the way? Out of character? Uh, Morgan, the white Morgan. kobold with wings. Yeah. The one you literally asked on a date. <laughs> I'm surprised uh, Venom's symbol hasn't left. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, where the hell was I? Uh, explaining the religion. Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. This was a religion... Oh, no. Mm. What is Mila. She is a neutral goddess that is half Asmar, half Dragon. You are cutting out so bad. Uh, oh my god, I'm going to kill Discord. I managed to hear him. I'm going my my I'm gonna unplug my mic and unplug it. And plug it back in. This is right. really annoying. Am I good? Yeah, yes. for now. For right now. Jesus Christ, I might just have to type in this. I guess that works. Yeah. <clears throat> testing, testing. 
Am I good? Uh, uh, a little spotty. Yeah. Yeah. Type type it in. All right. To Jeff I'll, now. I'll just type it in. Give me a hot second. We are so sorry about this, uh, people. No, well, this is life. <laughs> Yeah, we'll just have to we'll just have to toy around with his mic in the off time. See, mm -hmm. try to eliminate all possibilities of what it might be and figure it out. It might also be his computer itself because he says he's using an old one. That'll do it too. I mean, Venom, didn't you say that your computer was old? There we go. Of uh, Mila. Dragon goddess who is half dragon, half Asimar. Yeah, it is pretty old. It's like two, three years old. It's, it's your entire thing based on Fire Emblem? Yeah, kind of this religion. In okay. So much. That's all right. Okay. And quite a few of the characters as well, but regardless, I'll, I'll just keep on going. Uh, am I still good or nah? Um, nah? Considering how late it is, we'll just we'll just deal with it. Yeah, I'll just say for sake of brevity, you guys make. Back to chin. Got the sword. We save the people, I released animals to the wild, They're causing untold destruction to the nature. So yeah, I, I'll, I'll just call it there, you guys get... So where your, did this magic the rest of this... come from? Oh, okay. We'll, 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 we'll continue this next week. It's, yeah, with duck cutting with out, mic it, it, yeah. it, it's like, why okay. bother? We'll, we'll okay. figure it out. Yeah, we'll just start All next right. week with us getting back to town. Uh, add the golden hour later. Yeah. Y yeah. Meanwhile, oh, yeah, there the was parallel dimension. You were Kit. Kit, you were disconnected while we found out that there was also two hundred gold in the chest that we get oh. to split evenly. Okay. Ooh, dang. In addition to the get payment, getting paid. Uh, so what is that? An additional. Uh. <laughs> is that one? Is the archer also going to take a share? Not right, right probably now. Give it to her. So two hundred divided by six. I mean, I will gladly like, give up. I will gladly give up like my stream. Uh, let uh, I'll just. What's going on with your stream? I had to close it. Yep, everything's fine. So hopefully. So it's uh, oh, gold sorry to cut it short, chat. At that technical difficulties, hopefully we'll get it sorted out. Next. Okay. Yeah. Yep. All right. In that case, All right. This has been this group. This. <laughs> this is this group. This group. The Serial this planes group. The this group crusaders. The, pl the, sure, the ethereal planeswalkers. Oh. It's a little better. Oh. Okay. Okay. I think it's because I'm stopping the stream that it's getting better.